Hi everyone, welcome to Narish Technologies. In this video tutorial, simply we say in this playlist, we are going to discuss and not only discuss and of course, we are going to practice challenges, challenges on Core Java. See, here it is the importance of this playlist is, we are going to explain the concept after completion of a concept, we will give one practice question, we will give one practice question. It is nothing but just to prove yourself whether you are perfect or not in this concept instantly. So, that is the main aim of this playlist and we can say this series of videos. See here we are going to provide hundreds of hundreds of questions and who are, who are going to write, this means what those who are already completed core job, right. So, can eligible to go with these challenges. The first thing, first thing we are not going to explain is more detail is about any concept. Here it is we are giving just overview of a concept. After completion of a concept, you are going to write one code. Sir, in how many ways we you will ask the code means what? Generally, nowadays companies asking the technical interview questions in different ways, in different ways, not purely object type, objective type, right? Not purely coding type, right? In different ways they are asking the question. So here also, we are going to give different types of questions so that uh, you are able to write the questions what they are going to ask. So, according to the trend we are asking the questions here. So, better you can prove yourself, right, what type of questions they are asking nowadays in the interviews and are we able to answer or not all these things. So, different types of challenges you have to perform here. So, very sure, so before going to ask any question, so first of all, we are giving an introduction and overview of every concept. So, first of all, if you are not good at concept before going to start your challenge, right? First of all, you have to learn about that concept briefly and then only you can go with that challenge that is. Sir, where we can answer means what? Uh, just in the comment box, so you can comment your program. If it an ima image, so, that image also you can post, that is completely your wish. So, here it is suppose, where I can correct and I need more explanation for this, for these challenges. So, means what do not worry. First of all, is we are giving the problems only and followed by, is we are providing solutions also. For every challenge, we are providing solutions and of course, meanwhile, you can communicate with all the all the students, those who are, those who are following these videos and those who are so going to perform these challenges and all, you can communicate yourself through comments and all, right. So, here first we are going to start one simple challenge, simple challenge is Core Java, Core Java is a challenge one, is challenge one. The first one is we know that how to print a simple message in Java using std out system dot out dot print ln whatever the type of data you are passing that will display on the console. So, using this one and here it is my requirement is what and this is the output just hi, hello and bye. These three state statements you have to display, but you should use only one time a system dot out dot print ln. By using system dot out dot print ln only once, only once, we need to display these three words, these three words in three different lines, three different lines. 
and here it is a before going to display this. So, you should understand the concept of escape characters or we can say escape sequences. Some of the escape characters, here it is a slash t, we will give the tab space and here it is a slash n, we will give the new line, new line and here it is a slash r, we will give that carriage written, carriage written and many more. So, first of all you should learn about uh, escape characters and next one you should understand what is system dot out dot println and how it will display the information with the help of that. Simply you have to display this output hi hello bye use system dot out dot println only once that is ok. So, this is the simple challenge as we are going to start with a simple challenge right. Hope you will comment your code the complete code and other people also will give response and if explanation is required is we are going to provide the explanation and as well as those who are following this playlist also this will give chances are there ok. So, thank you all.